Well, hi, everyone. I'm Andy Asher. I'm the editor over here at Bloomer Boomer, and I interview interesting guests who are doing everything from changing a course in life to creating new and amazing things. And today we have someone who is helping to pioneer a new way to buy a home. After all these years, someone with a way to disrupt home buying in a good way. Now, he is uh, Bill Walker, and uh, Bill is the uh, Chief Revenue Officer at Unison, which is a company that partners alongside homeowners to invest in a home without any added debt, monthly payments, or interest. And I know it sounds pretty amazing, but we're going to find out how they're doing it. Hey, Bill, it's really exciting uh, having you here. Andy, thanks so much for having me on. I, I really appreciate it. Well, now tell me, the home buying process has remained unchanged for so long. Uh, what was the idea behind creating Unison? So really the ability to have an equity investor uh, has always existed, it seems, for commercial real estate and for small businesses and other enterprises that are out there. But it was never available to the family that is simply looking to purchase a home and not have as much debt associated with that purchase. And so we've stepped in, we have investors who want access to um, U.S. residential real estate, but they don't want to be landlords. Um, so we have this partnership with, you know, family homeowners and home buyers who, again, are interested in the financial flexibility while enjoying all of the benefits associated with owning a home. And let's face it, housing isn't getting any cheaper. It's outpacing uh, the growth and in incomes. And so I think that the need for our product is really front and center in, in today's economy. Do you consider what uh, Unison is doing is uh, disruptive in the home buying process? I would say that it's we view ourselves as more complementary in the home buying process or the home owning process. The, the person who owns a home typically, you know, only does two, three transactions in a lifetime. We can be there as a professional investor to help folks with all of the difficult, you know, aspects of buying and owning a home. And we feel as though we're additive to the process. We actually help de-risk it, if you will. Um, when you think about everything that happened, you know, about a decade ago, we're actually helping homeowners be less levered than they were then in helping the, all of the, the institutions. So we view ourselves as being more complimentary. And in fact, we do partner with loan officers and realtors okay. um, and lending institutions uh, to really try to make the process a lot better, easier, and more flexible for, for our consumers. So for comparison, now let's, let's talk about how the home uh, buying process has worked in the past. Uh, you know, you get an appraisal and you put a down payment and you, you get the title. Now, can you explain how Unison you know, fits into the, the new home buying process? Sure, absolutely. I would say that the two primary uh, value propositions from the consumer's viewpoint are that they can buy the home that they're already looking at and enjoy a monthly payment that's going to be anywhere from 20 to 25 percent lower than it otherwise would be because they're financing less of the purchase or they could actually buy a home that, that it is uh, in a price point that's 20 or 25% higher. So instead of having that longer commute, uh, maybe settling for a worse school district, maybe you know you've got aging relatives who are gonna be moving in and you need the extra square footage, you could increase your buying power by that same 20 or 25%. Um, additionally, folks have been on the sidelines. I think, you know, if you, if you think about a millennial audience or some of the younger generations who really are seeing home prices escalate far faster than their ability to save. This really gives complete um, complete segments of the population the hope uh, that they can actually go out and begin, uh, you know, planning those roots, living the American dream, having a place to, you know, raise their families in the form of being able to purchase a home where until Unison and our equity investment came along might have been out of reach or, or unattainable. This just isn't for new buyers, right? I mean, Unison can also help a current uh, homeowners uh, tap in to their equity. That's correct. So uh, we will make the same kind of an investment with alongside somebody who already owns their home. We'll give them a cash infusion based a uh, cash investment based on an independent third party appraisal of what their home is worth. And again, similar to the home buyer side, we're a partner alongside of that homeowner. If values go up, we win alongside of them. If values actually go down, uh, will help absorb some of that loss. And so where people might have used a HELOC or other instruments in the past uh, to be able to access the equity in their home, 
they're able to use a unison co-investment to get that same cash infusion for whatever you know purpose they may have uh, without that the, the added burden of a monthly payment, another monthly payment that they have to make. So that's kind of how you're you're different than than HELOC and uh, or a home equity loan. Absolutely. The primary difference is that we're making an investment just like, you know, an investor would in a business. We're investing in the home and we're, of course, hoping that uh, home prices appreciate, in which case both the, the homeowner and Unison win. Uh, and again, actually sharing in the in the decline if, if they go down. But the primary difference is no monthly payments, no interest rate um, and really bringing that financial flexibility that so many families are looking for today. You know, and two, the, the homeowner option seems especially relevant to folks who uh, are in or nearing retirement and then they, they want to stay in their homes. How does, how does Unison work, uh, work with that community or, or why should retirees maybe consider partnering with, with you guys? You're, you're absolutely right. I mean, there's certainly a, a massive um, demographic out there of folks who are concerned about having saved enough for retirement. They've got tons of equity in their home because they've lived in their home for X number of years and they've got a lot of equity there, but that doesn't really help them on a on a cash flow basis, on a financial basis to be able to um, afford all the you know financial demands of retirement. So there's several different uh, use cases that you could think of that, that I hear from our, our clients all the time. Um, you can access the equity in your home and then use that to buy an annuity product. And then that annuity product is generating a revenue stream that takes the place of the pensions and some of the other um, retirement vehicles that sort of that aren't as available today as they may have been in the past. Uh, another huge use case for that aging demographic is um, I love my home. I want to, you know, want to spend the rest of my life in my home, but I need to make some renovations to be able to prepare it for um, the fact that I'm going to age in place, to use the term. Uh, sure. So they can actually get an equity investment from Unison. We give them the cash. We invest alongside of them in their home, and they can then turn around and use that uh, that cash to make those important upgrades they need to be able to age in place. And then kind of the, the final use case, or, or another big use case that I could think of is maybe they have a number of debts that they that they still need to square away. They can take a, a Unison co-investment and use that to pay off all the credit card debts or um, other debts they may have accumulated, again, thereby releasing that from their cash flow and their you know budget requirement. Now, does Unison's role change at some point? We are always invested alongside the consumer. If you think about a bank, they tend to be on the opposite side of the table. We are truly invested in the success of the homeowner having a good financial experience and owning their home. Um, and we are in it for the long haul. We are a, we have uh, a 30 year commitment. So um, a consumer can buy us out early if they want, they can sell their home if they want. We don't stand in the way of that, but they can use our money for up to 30 years without making any payments. So you don't have that you know, kind of balloon sitting out there that you might with some of the other products that are out there in the marketplace. You have a 30 year opportunity to use the money uh, without any monthly payments. What else is on the horizon? Any new ideas that, uh, that maybe we should look out for? We're a, a young and fast growing company. So there's always, I would say, you know, exciting things on the horizon. Uh, to name a few, we certainly want to make um, describing how we do business easier and easier for the consumer to be able to understand how we differ from the traditional options like HELOCs and mortgages and other uh, debt instruments. Uh, introduction of calculators where folks might be able to run their own scenarios to really see, you know, because we're not for everybody, you know, but we do feel as though we should be in the conversation from a home finance standpoint. Can we have calculators out there to help with scenario planning and help uh, consumers get a better picture of what having a co-investment with Unison might be like. And then really, when I talk about a 30-year investment and a 30-year partnership with our consumers, we're always looking at and getting more aggressive with what are the other services we can provide you know, during that 30-year period? And not through the, van, not through the lens of, of additional revenue for Unison, quite frankly, but really through the lens of what are the pain points that homeowners have? Uh, maintenance, insurance, choosing contractors, what kinds of uh, home improvements are going to pay off the best. What are those pain points that consumers always have when they're owning a home for those 30 years? And how can Unison offer assistance 
or buying services at scale or other things along those lines. So I would say look out for uh, an improved experience, a lot more clarity and certainly uh, more services and more ways we can partner and make the consumer's life easier during that 30 year potential relationship we have. Now on the screen, uh, uh, under your name, we have uh, We Open Doors, which I guess is kind of a tagline. Uh, so that really addresses a lot of areas where you open doors for buyers and, or borrowers and what have you. Correct. I would say that, you know, people are looking for flexibility. They've, they've been on, if you think about the homeowner side, they've been potentially on a debt consolidation treadmill for, you know, the better part of their adult lives. Uh, maybe they have kids who are getting older and closer to college and, you know, looking at some of the numbers that are out there about the student debt, you know, issues that are out there being undersaved for retirement. We open doors to financial flexibility on the homeowner side. What else could you do with that money? How could you diversify your own financial uh, picture away from being so concentrated um, in your equity in the home? And obviously on the home buyer side, it is literally open, opening doors. I've been renting for X period of time. I haven't been able to save up for the down payment because there's other financial commitments that are uh, requiring of my time and resources. Maybe I can get a professional investor who can put up to 75% of the down payment into the uh, into the home buying process and really get me into the home that, I, that I've always wanted to be in sooner and start building up that equity for my own financial future sooner. So literally opening doors on the home buyer side. Unison almost sounds too good to be true. Now people must ask you all the time, is there a catch here? <laughs> It, we have actually even run, you know, marketing campaigns to that effect. You know, what's the catch? Um, there, the catch is when we try to educate consumers before they even do a deal of exactly what we are and what we are not. And so there is no catch. It is exactly as I described. You get to use Unison's money for up to 30 years uh, because our investors want access to the U.S. residential real estate market and they don't want to become landlords at mass scale to do it. Um, we share in the change in value. So uh, effectively, if, if you buy a home today and it goes up in value, we're going to share a portion of that change in value along with recouping our initial investment. The flip side is if it goes down, uh, we'll also help offset some of that loss in the same proportion that we share in the gain. So um, there really is no catch. It's just are you the type of person who is comfortable in a you know an Uber type of a, a world, an Airbnb type of a world where you've got a professional investor alongside of your home ownership experience instead of uh, you know Aunt Sally or your mom and dad? Okay, so for someone who's uh, who's watching our show today and they want to get into the program, what do they need to do? They can certainly go on to unison.com. There's a ton of information there, a lot more specifics about. Uh, you know, how we operate, some, some, uh, the ins and outs. And there's a phone number on the website, unison.com, where we've got folks standing by to be able to answer questions and really describe uh, specific to what the consumer is trying to accomplish, whether they're trying to pay down debts, uh, do a home improvement or buy their first home or a move up home. Uh, we've got folks that are ready to take those calls and really describe uh, exactly how Unison works and how we might be able to help uh, help folks out. So at unison.com, get more information there or a phone number to talk to somebody in person. Bill Walker, Chief Revenue Officer at Unison. Hey, it's been a pleasure. Thank you, Andy. I really appreciate it. I do too. Well, take care everyone and we will see you next time. So long.